Hey. You all right? Never been better. Sure don't look it. I can't let you on! Hey, hey, we're chill! Wasting your lives following us around like dogs. I crawled up your ass. Donnie, wait up. Don't do this. You could still change your mind. Get over here, man. Fuck this band. Not your crowd, not your noise. Do your own thing. Bastard. Shh. Gonna miss you something awful. See you in the next life, friend. Get the payload on the elevator. Arm it. 
Let gravity do its thing. Explosion rocks the foundation, tower crumbles, chaos, screaming roll credits. Exit window's gonna be tight. Jacking in. It's grass green, birds fly, cats eat bats, do rats shit gnats. Mainframe's not your playground, Murphy, come on. Evac announcement. Broadcast it across all frequencies and let's get moving. Sheesh. <laughs> Who wrote this manifesto? Really need me to answer that question? Jesus, Johnny. You've gone off the deep end. That's coming from a chair jock. Come on! Enemy contact! I'm engaging! Get ready! Get <gasps> oh, yourself spotted! Shido 2, bomb's name is what? Wrap it up! We got a Delta! The Demolitron. We're good to blow. Shaka Elite incoming! Run joint. for it! Shoot the cables! Get the rotors spinning! We're on our way! Not done yet. Still need to feed this to their subnet. This was never about corporate colonialism. This was about your groupie output, wasn't it? No, you wouldn't understand, Rogue. Giving you four fucking minutes. Chopper's not gonna wait one sec longer. Door lock breached. Arasaka's sons of bitches incoming. Fuck the spider. All world loves me. in on the access point. Slide in. Sweet icebreaker. Foreign, right? Just wonder if we know anyone who can switch the subnet protocol. Hilarious. You gonna help or not? Do spiders spin webs? It's time we caught some flies. Thanks, Murph. Now, just for good measure. Holy cyber cow. We're on TV. Take a look. now to Arasaka Tower. It's evacuation ongoing after an unidentified terrorist organization released a manifesto threatening violence. The terrorists stating their desire to, quote unquote, topple a monument to corporate colonialism. Night City's mayor, Imbole Ebunike, has issued a statement declaring that he will bring the full force of the law to bear in response to any act of terrorism. Going now to our reporter on the scene at Arasaka Tower. Hopefully he can shed some light on the situation as events unfold. All set. Now get out of there. They're moving up. Hit the roof quick.
Smasher. Told you, Johnny boy. Told you I'd end you someday. Try once more. Your associates. Who are they? How did you acquire fistful material? Gonna give good cop over there a chance to say something? Come on. <sighs> Which terrorist organization do you belong to? How did you acquire fistful material? <sighs> Don't look too pleased with your efforts. Why did you do this? To bring an end to the madness, you weak. Hajimiro. And you, who are you?
Heavier than he looks. Now, listen, dog. I have done exactly what you asked. So let's you and me figure this out. <laughs> Attention. Do you know a Reaper Doc whom you can trust? Uh, I know. Someone. We must get to Reaper Doc. Quickly. Victor. Will. Fix. Us. Up. We have to get there somehow. Call someone. Anyone. All right, all right. Greetings. My scanner indicates you are outside the service area. Just come pick me up. I need to get to Misty's Esoterica. In front of Vix. Of course. A vehicle is en route. It should arrive in less than 20 minutes. 
What are you doing? Hey! The personal link is damaged. Please proceed to insert the jack below the ear, though not too deep. There should be auxiliary neuro sockets between his lymph nodes, beneath the SCM muscle. If I hit a vein by mistake, he will die. Indeed, as he will if you do nothing. I think I have the socket. Now proceed to connect. Let's get him inside. I cannot hold it. I need to rest. That your blood? Misty! Pressure's tanking. It's neurogenic shock. He's dying. Gotta cut my way through the occipital bone. No other way. There is risk of... I know what I'm doing. How is he? Slower on the men than you, but looking better every day. How you feeling? Feel? I don't know, Vic. Ears are ringing. And I'm seeing shit. These hallucinations. Describe them to me. Blinding lights. It's loud. I'm on stage and I almost can't breathe. I'm so damn full of... hatred. Then I let it all out into a mic, and I realized it didn't help. I don't feel any better. And then, <laughs> promise not to laugh, I plant a bomb in Arasaka Tower. Nothing there to laugh about. Night City looked different, strange, and I hated it. Hated everybody. Every inch. It was too real. Even for a lucid dream. You weren't dreaming, V. Those were memories. There's a personality construct on that shard. Dreams you had were from his past. Hang on. You mean to say there's an actual terrorist in my head? Right now. That's right. Johnny Silverhand. Had his crowning moment about 50 years ago. AHQ bombing. Heard of it? It's his doing. People say he was buried under the rubble. <sighs> anyway, that's not what's important right now. Never given me that look before, Vic. What is it? You, uh... Don't got a lot of time left, kid. Say what now? The biochip. 
It's basically a bomb. Fuse lit already. You don't have much time left. Much... life. A few weeks tops. Silverhand's construct is overriding your consciousness. Gradually taking over your body until... One day you'll just be... gone. V, it's important you get all this. You'll fix me up, right? Vic? If I could, I would, V. Believe me. But this is... It's way beyond what I know how to do. You're the best of the best, Vic. Why can't you help me? You want the long story or the short? Don't admit a thing, not one deep. Okay. There was... is a construct. A psyche on the chip. That of Johnny Silverhand. You jacked it in your chip slot. Nothing happened, right? Until you died. Bullet in the head from Dexter to Sean. But how do you come back from something like that? Low caliber, you lucked out. Not least thanks to another poor decision by Mr. Deshaun. The nanites off the chip started fixing the damage. Then they took your hand and coaxed you off the path toward the light. You're Dr. Victor and I'm your monster. Perfect. Your body's only a body. You can modify it, replace it with chrome, hell, get a new one altogether. Your mind, though? Oh, that's a whole nother story. From the biochip's perspective, your brain cells are a tumor that needs to be scooped out, while your body's an empty shell to hold the construct. So this fucking terrorist wants to wipe me and take my place, take my body. It's not willful on his part, it's automatic. Inevitable. And neither of you can stop it. Vic, you've always come through for me. If there's nothing you can do to help me, then... Well, what the hell do I do? Tell me, please. Vic. I wish I knew, kid. Misty? You're asking too much from an old-timer like Vic. Come on, V. Let's get you home. died. And I thought I was gonna die. With him in my sleep. Sleep's a small hint of death. The inevitable. Can't actually tell if I'm awake now. I mean, I could be dead already, right? Not something to focus on, V. Let it go. Here. Got some meds for you. Omega blockers. Taken regularly, they'll keep things from progressing too quickly. Also, they should keep that guest of yours calm and quiet. Pseudoendotrizine's from me. Effect will be opposite. It'll speed things up. Free the demon, so to speak. Giving me a pill to prod that son of a bitch so he can kill me faster? Listen, you're likely to be fine for a while. But sometime down the road, it could turn into pure agony. I'm giving you options, honey. The brain can be tricked. Plain old painkillers do that. Your psyche's gonna die, V. You'll feel your old self slipping away. At some point, you won't recognize yourself. It'll be terrifying. It'll be painful. But it doesn't have to be. 
fuck I need pills for? Ought to just stick a gun in my mouth and pull the trigger. Well, that way you'd kill two souls. Is that what you want? I gotta lie down. Here, got one more thing for you. Vic pulled this out of your skull. A lucky charm? Promise you'll try to get some sleep. Didn't you hear? My condition's terminal. What good can this do? Don't be silly. As long as you're alive, there's hope. And don't let anyone tell you otherwise. You really think I can make it? Survive this? Of course you can. I mean, you did already die and come back once, didn't you? Misty, wait. Uh, about Jackie. Yeah? He talked about you. Like lots. We got into a fight. Right before he went off to do this job. He wasn't mad at you. I hope you know that. I know. I just wish our last moments together could have been... different. But right now, you need rest. So sleep. Please sleep. Gotta get out of here, understand? And I'll kill anyone who gets in my way. You included. Need a smoke. Where'd you stash yours? smoke then go out and get some just need one last one jesus fucking christ man the fuck kind of joy toy are you supposed to be fucking ghost off <laughs> who you work for start talking Fuck. Fuck. Fucking chip. Rip the thing out myself. No, wait! See you never, asshole. Now like that! Stick some iron in your mouth and pull the trigger! 
I can feel it. Our minds touch on you. I'm like mold on fruit creeping into you. Nothing I can do about it. You hear me? I'd puke if I fucking could. It's just a copy of the Edgram. I'm out there somewhere. Gotta be. Leave me alone! Get out! Just get the fuck out! Led to the head, only thing that can fix this. Hear me, asshole? A bullet to the fucking brain! Fuck me.
Algebra here. We must meet. Come to Tom's diner. Why would I do that? Because I am the one who saved your life. I haven't managed to get my head straight yet. Not after everything that happened. That will not happen anytime soon. And so what? If you intend to leave, way, you must re-enter the ring. Double has yet. already told me. Thomas Diner. Prepare for I am waiting. As we head into the weekend. Oh. NCPD, open up! Barry! We know you were in there! We're here to help! Don't got no fucking warrant! Cut the bullshit! Just open up! We came here as colleagues. Nothing else. Haven't heard from you in a while. See? Hello? No, the worst thing is about this place. It's all in the report. Oh, I read it. Except there's no mention of me telling you to delta the fuck out of there. Yeah, no biggie. Not like that cyber psycho was a tank on two chrome legs. What the fuck were you thinking? There's a reason Max Tack exists, you know. Civilians were in danger. What was I supposed to do? Just watch them get mowed down? Listen, you... Me and every fucking cop in this city might as well be a civilian next to MaxTac. The day they give us the gear they're packing, go right ahead. Be the hero. Save the fucking day. But until then, you keep your head down and listen to me. That understood? Look so bad. 
then, in the car, I doubted you would survive. Why'd you help me anyway? I needed you to leave. That hasn't changed. This about the biochip? That why I'm here? Hmm. I hear it's damaged beyond the repair. Any attempt to extract it would be disastrous. Fatal for you. Vic likes to talk, I guess. Not many could do what he did. You should be thankful. What's it you actually want from me? To begin, you must tell me where to find Evelyn Parker. Evelyn, what's she to you? She and Yorino Barasaka had intimate relations. She knows how to get to him. You're thinking I ought to have a word with her myself. She promised to help me get rid of the chip. I would not count on that. She's likely gone very far away. Why you figure she skipped town? I tried to locate her, but had no success. I suspect she covered her tracks. You said Parker could help you remove the relic. Does she work for a corporation? Suspect so, yeah. Evelyn was knowledgeable about the relic. Had a large chunk of classified info. An enigma to be sure. But she showed that slyness he get in corporal agents. You know the kind. I too possess this slyness you speak of. You got tossed out, lumped with the outcasts, easily. Or have you forgotten? Hmm. Sorry I couldn't be of any help. Don't have any time to lose, so... Be, wait. I need you. Yorinobu Arasaka must answer for this crime of patricide. <laughs> Looking for justice. In Night City. I seek revenge. Much more feasible here. I have allies prepared to bring Yorinobu to his knees. The only thing I need is proof. And you think... They'll trust the word of a merc. I have nothing better now. Also, I know no one here. And I am a fugitive. I am hunted. So what? We stroll into Arasaka HQ and announce that Yorinobu's a kin killer? That he murdered Saburo? We'll get the hearing before reasonable people in a neutral location. Certain procedures will be used to establish the truth. A lie detector? Forget it. In that case, another option. You are dying. You do not know how to save yourself. A chip, the relic, is a culprit. Technology made by Arasaka. Technology they alone know. This corporation can save you as easily as it can make you disappear. It is merely about getting the right people on your side. Politics. You mean people like Anders Hellman? You know this name? How? Prepped for the heist. Thoroughly. Relic is Hellman's design, his creation. And true. He's a pole. I was thinking of one much more powerful. Besides, Anders Hellman escaped to Arasaka, betrayed it. Now, Hanako-sama. I would first like to ask you... Fucking Saka scums everywhere. Hey! I was listening to that! Shut up! Nobody except you wants to watch that shit about that corpo cunt. What did you say? You heard me. Let it go, Takamura. Hmm. At least one of you's got some fucking sense.
Last thing we want to do is to draw attention. I'm sorry. I stupid the reflex. Thanks for the offer. Need to think about it. Get back to you. I need time to plan, organize. You stand to gain much if you help me. All I ask is that you do not leave the city. Leave? Why would I leave? Need help. Best chance I'll find the right person here. Someone other than Arasaka specialist? There's no one. No alternative. Actually, we just talked about some. With a bit of luck, I'll track down Evelyn. If she could not help you before, she will not manage to now. Honor Among Thieves. Ever heard of it? Yes. I thought it ironic. Thieves have none. There's just honor, I believe. Your noble Arasaka would agree, I'm sure. The Parker woman will not help you. Why are you? I would think about the plan B. Anders Hellman. He invented the relic. If I want to get rid of it, he's my man. And if that means picking another fight with Arasaka, so be it. Hellman defected from the company. I myself spent many days looking for him. He... What's the expression? Dropped off the face of the earth. Why are you looking for Hellman? He was the one to alert Sabro-san to Yorinobu's schemes. He knew both of them well and could be an important witness. Corporal rats will squeal when hanging by their tails. For several days, I collected the information. All leads point to one place. The club called the Afterlife. I was quickly dismissed by the Queen of Fixers there. Rogue. She take you for a suit? No. She saw me as Saburo-sama's killer. Rogue's well informed. Gets wind of most things that happen in the city. Might be worth asking her about Hellman. I wish you luck. Dolma is choosy, expensive, and rude. I cannot stay here any longer. Do what you want. Look for Parker, Hellman, whoever. I must see some friends. Call in some favors. When my people in Arasaka are ready to listen, I will call you. Till then, I guess. If by some miracle you find Hellman, please notify me. He and I have unfinished business. Zapper dumples and filth. In some ways, Night City never changes. Arasaka's still a despotic machine, and the world's on a collision course with chaos. But hey, at least Rogue's still alive. Leave me the fuck alone! You don't need to speak out loud to talk to me. What do you want from me? Are you still upset about the other night? You tried to kill me. Well, I gave it some thought and changed my mind. Don't want you dead anymore. Fuck off, you psychopath. Hey, wasn't easy for me either. You woke up in a landfill, I woke up in your head. Wrestling with your thoughts, memories. Think we're even. And I've taken a step back, looked at things. Think we might be able to help each other. We could start with Rogue. Her and I go back to the Stone Age. You're the ghost of Christmas past, asshole. Any friends you had are either dead or so old their memory's gone. Johnny Silverhand died a legend. Nobody forgets that. So you fucking know, Rogue. What do I say to her? Got a talking brain tumor claims it's her old friend Johnny? Trust me, Rogue's heard dumber shit than that. Way back when you weren't even an itch in your daddy's ball sack. Don't need convincing. Seeing your memories, gross. Rogel danced any tune I play, or just get us to the afterlife. There is no us.
Saburo Arasaka. The longtime head of the Japanese mega corporation was reported slain on the premises of the Konpeki Plaza corporate hotel while attending a family gathering. Saburo Arasaka's son, Yarinobu Arasaka, has cast blame for his father's murder on public rivals, although he has not yet provided evidence supporting this claim. According to market analysts, the CEO's death may have been a desperate attempt to divert attention away from the company's ongoing internal issues. After the break, we ask experts how they see Arasaka rebounding from the crisis. Try Just out our freshly developed new tastes yeah, and let yeah, your we'll tongue be amazed. Don't worry. Oh, all Don't carry nothing. So when did this tower go cuckoo again? This is a private matter, so just move along. Wait, he might know Barry. Is there anything I can do? Maybe. You know Barry at all? More or less. I struck up a convo once or twice. He's a friend from the precinct. Left the force not long ago. He broke down after his best friend died. We're worried he'll do something stupid. Relax, Patrolman. Barry's got nerves of steel. He's just a spiteful old bastard. Mendez! Could you check on him when he's chilled down? Sure, why not? It's not like we're miles apart. Thanks. Just be patient. Cops falling in rough times can be touchy. Let's see what I can do. Hey, Barry. Everything all right in there? I'm gonna take that as a yes. Uh, try again later. See what you got. What I like to hear.
children's models are worth nothing. Okay. Maybe a more processor. Yes. Ask so, it. So, uh, what were we going to talk about yesterday? Johnny, did you see what happened? Something feels off here. You don't say. Don't mean the wreck. I mean the run. City's most courteous chauffeur ups and drives away from the scene of an accident. Bye.
the miners were able to survive without access to food and fresh water for two weeks. Fortunately, after their rescue and following a brief rest for technical evaluation, the miners were able to immediately return to work. Moving from below the earth to above it, Militech has announced plans to establish a new colony on the Red Planet. The proposed base will be subdivided into three areas, industrial, scientific, and residential. Ten residential modules are already available for purchase at a starting rate of one million So... Hey, look. What now? Call for backup, crack some heads open, drag the bodies inside. I told hey. you. Hey. you go. The respect to the man. Get you anything? You bent? No. This trouble? The net around me? You woke it. You know it. I lost everything. Let me be you. plain. Again. Solve your own problems. Clean up you know your what, own Will? shit. Go fuck yourself. Be careful who you bargain with. Rogue. Wanted to talk. It's okay. Hmm. Not here. Not there. Who are you? Name's V. And what is it you want, V? All these years, it's really her. Fucking bro, just kicking it back on a couch at the afterlife. Don't mess with her, she's got MRI. See right through you. Give her the truth. Need your services. Gotta track a guy down. Mm-hmm. Anders Hellman. Hotshot engineer. Worked for Arasaka. Millisec. Anders Hellman. Pinpoint him for me? Huh. Thanks. Jump in too soon. First, my help's got a price. Second and third, Dexter Deshawn, Jackie Wells, Tipa. Multiple bells ringing, B. Left a lot of bodies behind. Death walks in your wake. Chalk that up to bad luck? There's the bitch I know. Ask her about Sokka Tower. How they shot me up right in front of her. Wanna go through obits? Really? Fine. Johnny Silverhand. Zeroed inside our socket tower. Before your very eyes. Got more if you want. Or we could just talk. Got balls on you, boy. Don't like that on everybody, but they seem to suit you. Anyways, feelings be damned, I've always said. This is pure biz. You need my help, so get those eddies ready. Mm-hmm. See? Uh-huh. And if I don't have the scratch, it's fuck off and have a nice day? No. More like come back when you do. Them's the breaks. Mm-hmm. Then see ya. Soon. You know where to find me. Hey, interested in some work? Doing what? A business opportunity. Cargo transport. Get from A to B, quick and quiet. Interested? I'm listening. It's simple. You go to the Kabuki waterfront, collect the package, give me a call, then I tell you how to deliver it. Very straightforward. Yeah, everything except my pay. Don't worry, there's a bonus in it for you. Imported and duty free. Duty free and detail free. Yes, but altogether fair. It's a simple job, generously compensated. Do you accept? 
Yeah, sure, I'm in. Good, I knew we'd find acceptable terms. Head to the Kabuki waterfront, then search for a fridge with the words, no future. Once you locate it, collect what you find inside, then call me for further instructions. Till then, I guess. Not there. Jeff, hang on just a little longer, Chu. Ripper's on the way. Hey, look. over there. Fuck you smoking, Chum. I didn't see no thing. Yeah, you didn't, but I did. It was like... down the scratch. someone who's been extorting regular hard-working folks. Our public enemy's name is Blake, and he is one slippery motherfucker. More info on him and his M.O. attached.
shit kicking back or what? Uh a problem, you got rid of it. I'm happy, the client's even happier. Good work, V. Get closed. Let's hear what Dennis has to say. Hey, got a status? Could have Find told the package? me the package was a man. If it was a box of bananas, I'd use the post office. Get over it. Well, who is he? The ambassador to Mexico. Jesus, it doesn't matter who he is. I prepared a car for you. Put the man in the trunk and head to Northside. Okay. One more thing. Watch for tigers. They've got their sights trained on your new companion.
I never hurt nobody. Please. Job's done. I see that. Well done. Excellent work. Holding in there all right, Hariyoshi? They need to give me hope. So who is this guy? He'll tell you his story. Hariyoshi? In Japan. Brain sergeant. Top of all. Good to instinct. One day, Taiga Crow boss needs surgery. But both die on table. Taiga Crows were very angry. I hide in boat, swim to America. Here, Dennis saved me. But there is secret. I killed Taiga Crow boss on purpose. World best surgeon, make no mistake. Early warning about the Tigers would have been nice. I had a hunch you'd manage this just fine. Given that you're here now, I see I was right. This is all very heartwarming, but you haven't paid me yet. I know, here. May this blade serve you well. What's your name again? Green Sergeant, World Best. Good to instinct. Where are you from exactly? Green Sergeant, World Best. To instinct. Fucking help you are. <laughs> 